I want you to understand na hindi lang tayo overseas Filipino workers. We're not workers. We're warriors. Tell me if you're capable of remembering a specific feeling when you listen to this. That is the very sound you hate to hear every single freaking morning you wake up. Tama ba? Nandito tayo ngayon sa abroad in the UAE to work. And that very sound is a reminder that we have to actually face the challenges ahead. You're lucky if ever you're waking up in the morning and you love what you're doing. But for the most people, it's gonna be a huge challenge. And let's just focus on that specific sound, that specific reminder. Hoy, gising ka na. Dami mo pang gagawin. Kahit na hindi mo gusto yung ginagawa mo, you have to. But you know what? As much as we hate that sound, that is the very sound that allows us to go up, get out of our bed, and do the things that we have to do. Dahil lang sa sound na yun, we are capable of buying the things that we need, capable of buying the things we want, and capable to send money to our loved ones. This sound is a reminder that my friends, kahit na yung mga bagay na hindi mo gustong gawin, pero gagawa mo para sa mga bagay na gusto mong makamit. And that is a reminder to every one of us here, right? May mga pagkakataon talaga sa buhay na kailangan natin gawin yung mga bagay na hindi natin kayang gawin or hindi natin gustong gawin. Just for us to have the capability, my friends, to get what we want. You're also a reminder of this sound. Kasi, you're here. I mean, you could just go ahead and lie down after 5 o'clock, right? Nood ka ng Netflix, date ka sa jowa mo. Diba? And then just it, like stay on a specific job, stay on that specific place. Pero hindi, nandito ka because you invested specific amount of time, specific amount of money, because you don't want to stay on a place where you are right now. Di, hindi ka naman siguro nag-enroll at magkaroon ng course para lang naman kang mahang na certificate doon. Right? Hindi naman siguro, I mean, that's, that's not the very thing why you're here. The very reason why you're here because you have a specific dream and you wanted to go to a specific place you want. And you're willing to wake up extra single morning, may extra morning pa na dapat pinagpahinga mo. Pero pumasok ka. For what? Six months? One year? Kasi hindi lahat ng Pilipino, hindi lahat ng OFW, at hindi lahat ng taong nandito sa abroad ay may kakayahan para pumunta sa lugar na gusto nilang pumunta and act on it. Sana someday, may sarili na akong bahay, may sarili na akong trabaho. Sana someday, hindi na akong magtrabaho, I will be my own boss. And most of the people are like that. They just wish. They just dream. But very few people actually wake up and execute on the dream. And do not underestimate your efforts right now, you being here, being capable of graduating. Kasi karamihan ng mga tao, are on their comfort zone. They just want to stay where they are. Pero ikaw, hindi ka katulad nila. At hindi lang pangarap yun. Ginagawan mo ng paraan yung pangarap mo. Gusto kong sabihin sa lahat na sana, balang araw, kung sakaling nakamit mo na yung bagay na gusto mong kamitin, wag na wag mong kakalimutan yung mga taong tumulong sa'yo kung saan ka man nandyan. Always give back, my friends. Kasi alam mo yung sitwasyon na walang wala ka. Kuya Darbs, meron bang way para hindi ako maloko ng jowa ko? I always, uh, palagi akong natatanong ng question na yan. Is there a way for me to prevent na lokohin? Pwede, Kuya Darbs, ano, um, hindi ko siya papalabasin ng bahay. Dapat kuha ko yung password niya. Diba? Kung ganoon, um, dapat lahat ng galaw niya nakareport. But to tell you frankly, out of every question that I have and all the realizations and all the heartbreaks that I 
able to go through the answer to that question you can never prevent someone nasaktan ka lokohin ka pero here's the thing if you just love yourself well enough if you just know your self-worth you know your value you can just trust yourself that kahit na lolo ko ng taong mahal na mahal mo basta mahal mo din yung sarili mo masasaktan ka lang pero hindi ka maduduro and that is the reason as to why you're here it's self-love mahal mo yung sarili mo at alam mo yung value mo never allow yourself your present situation to dictate your potential in the future Five years ago, seven years ago, eight years ago, I was just someone who doesn't have a dream, a pathless OFW. But what I have from the rest, na wala, is I have a goal. And I know where I want to go. And all of you right here, right now, dahil mahal niyo yung sarili niyo, you're capable of doing something to increase your Through self-love, you're capable of doing the things most people are not capable of doing. Kasi kala nila hanggang dun na lang sila. Pero dahil sa pagmamahal na meron ka, hindi sa jowa mo, pero sa sarili mo, my friends, I think that is something that you should be proud of. I want you to understand that we always brand ourselves as overseas Filipino workers. Right? Mahirap magtrabaho sa isang bansa na malayo sa pamilya, wala kang nakilala, at hirap na hirap kang magtrabaho kasi minsan umuuwi ka pa sa bed space mong napakaingay. Real talk yan. And most of the time, since we don't have self-value, we also see ourselves as just workers. Because of love, you're here. Love for your family. Love for your dreams. And you're capable of going through extreme circumstances, going all those trials, capable of getting and willing to do all those sacrifices just for you to pursue the dreams that you want for you and the dreams that you want for your family. So please, after this message, I want you to understand that hindi lang tayo overseas Filipino workers. We're not workers. We're warriors. Each and every one here right now are warriors. Pinaglaban mo yung pangarap mo. Because of that, I don't deserve a clap. You deserve that. So can you please clap for yourself right now? Patuloy sa pangarap, kaibigan. Maraming salamat. Thank you very much. Thank you.